I'm back with another video and today as you can tell by the title I'm going to be doing a wash and go with the Wetline Extreme Professional Styling Gel in 10. I've never used this one before so this will be the first time I've used this hold. I've used the one with the clear top. I'm going to be using the Kinky Curly Original Curling Custard Natural Styling Gel. So I'm going to be using both of these together. And as of right now, all I have in my hair is the Kinky Curly Not Today Leave-In Conditioner. So let me show you what I got underneath here. Normally when I do my wash and goes, I only do one section at a time. So I have my hair section into four. So I've already shampooed, conditioned, and deep conditioned my hair with heat. Only thing in my hair, like I said before, is my leave-in conditioner. So I'm gonna do one section at a time. And because I wanna keep that heat in, I'm gonna wanna pull out one section at a time just to make sure that it stays moisturized underneath there and stuff. So, let me show y'all what it look like. Had it all twisted up in there. And this is what my hair is looking like. It looks pretty good. It looks moisturized. Okay, it smells good. It smells good. Let's see what this one smells like. Yeah. Listen, before I started this video, I had to like literally take a knife and like cut the edge of this because they had this sealed down. And I got both of these products from Target, so leave it to Beaver. Boom. So I'm about to struggle with this. I'm not putting my mouth on this. But listen, we're still in this for the time. Even if it wasn't on this, my mouth on here. I cannot open this. Ooh, that was difficult. Oh, this smells really good. This smells like. I don't know, like a, some type of fruit, but this, this does not smell like that at all. Two different smells, these don't, these don't smell like at all. So I'm gonna just do little sections at a time. To, I like to like kind of finger detangle a little bit before I start putting the product in, just to see what my hair is looking like. I'm gonna start off with the Wet Lime Extreme, just to see. And this is what it's looking like. And I'm gonna, I always like to start at my roots to make sure my roots are good. And I'm just gonna go all the way down and then you just apply as you need. Sometimes I'm a little heavy handed, so I'm gonna try not to be that heavy handed because so I'm gonna be using two gels. Well, once it's styling custard, but it's still so it's a styling gel. I don't know if I need this. Cause this this is doing it whole by itself. Wow. Sis, this is this got my curls clumping. Look at that. Look at them curls. Look at them curls, girl. Look at them curls. Look at them curls, girl. This gel might be it. This combo. So I got some water in here because I feel like I need some water on here. Uh oh. A little bit of water. You don't be working on no, no dry hair. My curls don't even look bad without anything even in it. Well, besides the leave-in conditioner. Do I even need anything else? But see, I'm not gonna say this is my favorite yet until I see what it looks like when it dry. That's, now that's, that's when, that's when you know when it dry. Cause when it's wet, everything look good when it's wet. My mouth all open. <laughs> 
Because <laughs> listen, I'm amazed. I haven't done a wash and go in a minute because, because of the corona. And I know I've been saying in some of my videos that I've been wearing uh, a scrub cap to work and nobody sees my hair. So I'm like, what's the point? Because I don't have my hair out. But I was just like, I, I've been needing to do a to do a wash and go. Like I've been wanting to, to do one for a while. I might just have to figure out how to, you know, keep my wash and go still pop underneath the cap. So when I'm not at work, you know, I can wear my hair out. How y'all been doing? How y'all been holding up through the corona? Comment and let me know. I need y'all to interact with me. Cause if I'm gonna sit here and talk to y'all, I need y'all to talk to me too. Say something to me. Say something real nice. You don't say nothing at all. Just comment and let me know what y'all been doing. Cause all I've been doing is uh going to work, eating. I haven't even worked out. I've been working, usually I work out a few times a week. But I promise you, I feel like this whole pandemic got me uh, lazy. Section one, almost down, almost done. This is the last part of this section. Then I'm gonna show y'all what it look like. Oh, look at her. Look at her. Let me show y'all. Let me show y'all. Y'all see her? But look, these two gels. They doing something. Anyways, I'm going to continue to do my hair. And I'm gonna let you guys to continue to watch because I know you're gonna watch all the way through. I know you are. Wow, y'all, the poppage. I can't even, I'm so distracted. Can't even finish this video right. Look at that. So I'm gonna continue the same process all over my head. I'm gonna let you guys watch and then I'll let you guys see what the final results are at the end when I'm done and stuff. So. Make sure y'all putting water on your hair as y'all go. You don't want to put product on dry hair. It's just, that's just not gonna work. Like you never want to work with dry hair, especially if you're doing a wash and go. Like that's why it's called a wash and go. Like you wash your hair and your hair is wet. So you do something to your hair while it's wet.
is the final look. I'm all done applying both my gels, the wet line extreme and the kinky curly custer. So I'm going to go sit underneath the dryer for about an hour and that's it. And then I'll let my hair air dry for the rest of the time. And once my hair has air dried all the way through, so I'll come back on here and show you guys the final results after my hair has completely dried. Oh.